Hey everyone, welcome back to my kitchen. I have got a great, simple recipe for you guys today, and I'm bringing you a taste of New Orleans. Uh, we love New Orleans. We visited there a few times. Right, actually, when we took our kids on our first big road trip ever for them, we spent two nights in New Orleans before we went on to Pigeon Forge, Tennessee. It was a great time. They've got some great memories, and we've all been wishing we could go back, but we're not traveling anywhere. So I decided to bring us a taste of New Orleans here, and I've been making these super easy, individual grilled muffaletta sandwiches. And I'm gonna jump right into it. I'm gonna show you how I do this. I know you're gonna love this one. Okay guys, so here's everything we need to put together these mini grilled muffaletta sandwiches. This is so easy, you guys. You're just gonna love this. I use English muffins for this. Um, just Thomas's English muffins from the grocery store. Here's olive salad, which makes a muffaletta a muffaletta. We'll need three slices of just a hard salami three slices of a good smoked ham, this is a mesquite smoked ham, one slice of provolone cheese, and another slice of Swiss cheese. And that's it. That's how we're gonna build our sandwich. I am gonna touch on this olive salad though. We've been using this a lot. And see, I've already got another full jar here. Um, this is from New Orleans. This is from the famous Central Grocery Deli that invented the muffaletta, or so they claim. And it's, I, they just have this here on the shelf at my grocery store. Guys, we're only seven hours from New Orleans, so they do have this sitting on the shelf. If you go to your grocery store, there are some other brands of olive salad. Uh, there's another brand called Bascali, I think, is another famous brand. Um, but if, in case you don't have this on your groceries, in your grocery store, I'm gonna leave a link below so you can order some from Amazon if you really wanna give this sandwich a try. But you've gotta have the olive salad. The olive salad is what makes the muffaletta, the muffaletta. All right, let's put this sandwich together. Okay guys, so first things first, obviously gonna open up our English muffin here. I'm trying not to uh, slice my hand. And I am gonna, I am gonna go ahead and mention too that actually the word muffaletta is a form of Italian bread. Okay, and so when, Apparently, you can use the word muffaletta to describe an Italian bread, and then this Italian bread is actually what they use to make the famous muffaletta sandwich, okay? Before somebody gets mad at me and says the olive salad is not the only thing that makes a muffaletta, okay, it's the bread as well. But today, for my mini muffalettas, we're using an English muffin, guys. All right, so, got this split open, and then we're gonna take some of our olive salad and just gonna spread it as, as well as you can on both sides. Now this stuff is salty and briny and super, super flavorful. I love really briny foods like capers and things. So I'm just gonna put a little bit on both sides. Okay, so we're gonna start with the cheese and then just just gonna sandwich the meat right in here. And then another piece of cheese. Easy peasy, I told you. Okay, so now we're gonna put it all together. I'm gonna heat up my pan with some butter and some olive oil and we are gonna grill this mini muffaletta. Okay guys, so I've got my little grill pan here and I'm just gonna put just a little bit of oil. You don't need to go too crazy. It's just for flavor, really. And then just a little bit of butter. Just, you know, butter. Okay, so I'm gonna take my sandwich here. I'll put together and I'm just gonna pop it here in the middle. I do actually get a large lid and kind of cover. I do think it helps, um, you know, help it heat up in the middle and help the cheese get nice and melty. So we're just gonna let that go for uh, a couple minutes. Okay guys, so I can really kind of smell this. I am using some tongs just so I can kind of keep it all together. And 
with it. Do the same thing. I'm going to cover it back up and let that steam kind of help the center of the sandwich. And just a couple more minutes to go and we can eat. I'm so hungry, you guys. Why do I make these videos when I'm so hungry? Okay, so we are going to flip this over. Ooh, you can see those really pretty little grill marks on there. It is looking good, guys. I'm going to go ahead and take it off and put it on the plate. much for joining me today guys this is honest to goodness my lunch uh, I'm gonna be pairing this up with some crispy battered potato wedges I made in the air fryer and yes I will be sharing that recipe soon um, thanks so much for joining me I am gonna go pour myself a coca-cola and eat uh, if you are new to my channel stopping by for the first time please hit that red subscribe button down below and the notification bell. That way you'll get notified every time I get a new recipe uploaded to YouTube. Guys, if you enjoyed this recipe, if you enjoyed this video, please leave me a thumbs up on your way out. Y'all have a great weekend. Stay safe out there and I'll see you in another video really, really soon.